ethnomanian vision namin, our vision is that we will carry into new market our over a century old tradition of quality and integrity. Consumers will take pleasure in reaching for our products and services because they are the best value for money. Our food and beverage brands will be in every household and every retail outlet. That's what we want to That's our vision. We will meet our consumers' everyday needs, delighting their everyday. Through our products and services, every occasion to drink and eat will bring enjoyment. Corporate, uh, medicine by corporate affairs and business planning, or maybe 
it's a corporate affairs office. So, kung isa depende dito sa structure. And sometimes, it is a function under the corporate human resources. So, nag-big decision. Pero, basically, yun pa rin, parang uh, binibring down mo yung direction from the corporate office. Tapos, yung kanya-kanyang business, may own way din sila of um, uh, uh, carrying out the communication functions in ways that would be relevant to their own business. Later on, Ms. Ken uh, Lichau, who will be here, uh, there are some pre-prepared questions that um, we received and have given that to her. So, she will share with you, at least you get it first hand from them, kung ano yung mga modes and uh, programs and way of communicating, the, uh, communication tools they use in communicating to the employees of the company and our external funding. Okay? So basically, I don't know if you share it, but it's just that the whole, it's not like that, it's under each box. So I don't know if you share it, but it's just like that. So it's just like that, it's just like that. Uh, way of summarizing it lang ha, kasi uh, we are about 70,000 employees so we can continue oh. coming back to that. <laughs> okay. Can I need to share my <laughs> And then, uh -huh, I'm sure this is the other function. This is also close to my heart because I belong to the recruitment office, uh, the recruitment um, part of HR. I'm sure this is something that all of you will be interested in. To see. You're now third year students. Second year. Second year. Maybe later on, I mean, you know, we'll have a round down of your names and uh, 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 maybe you might have some questions related to this. Um, you want to know your the function. Dito, I will speak of corporate office, no? Kasi meron din kami HR sa iba-ibang businesses. And then they also have their recruitment uh, function. Um, done by the HR person. So, dito sa, uh, pero basically, yung flow na yan, hindi ko na lang detail kasi we cannot naman share with you all the details. So, but the, the basic flow, mm -hmm. it starts with paper screening. What is paper screening? That can you send your resume. So, you make sure that your resume are, you know, are very concise uh, and it really reflects uh, who you are and the strengths that you have and if uh, you, you have um, subjects that give you opportunities to have work-related experience, you can put that there. And then if you have all the job training, you know, then you want. Kasi if you're fresh graduate, there's very little opportunities naman for you to to show how you work except how you do things in school. So, yung mga major joy na ninyo activities, yung mga school projects, uh, papers, I don't think they are not important. They are because they are with us. Ways uh, they are the things that later on when you are interviewed for a job, dun makikita how you work, no? how you relate in a group activity, how you work individually, the discipline that um, you exhibit while working. Dun makikita yan sa mga projects. So, kung isa nakatainis at nakagawa ng marami ng issues, marami ng issues yung project yan. But I think basically what they want from you is to have that discipline. And then that initiative, the creativity or innovativeness to, to do something that you think is not possible to be done. Na mga capture yan sa mga projects na ginagawa nyo, mga papers na pinagsusunod at nyo. So that goes for the papers screening. And then after, afterwards, mm. we say, mas do yung papers nyo, magdadala nyo na. Ngayon, ang, ang style is you do it online. Um, I will also share with you yung um, uh, website ng San Miguel when employees ask us, so kung paano mo pa kami mag-a-apply? So when you visit our website, it's www.sanmiguel.com.ph and you click on careers and then meron doon mag-open mag a screen, you can upload there your uh, resume. That's it. So, pero we also sometimes, sometimes at times we see hard copies. Ang hard copies, kung isa may limitation, because once a hard copy gets uh, to go to one person, hindi na yan masishare na madaming tao, sayang naman yung, yung what you can offer or yung qualifications mo makita. So, it's always good then na padalan yung pag may site na no, you're supposed to put it. Kasi we maintain uh, the talent bank na ito. And then, uh, after, let's say, wow, you were called, nakita yung papers no, and then you were called, yes, uh, usually the next step would be an exploratory or a preliminary interview. It's usually done here. I usually do that. We have several people who do that in the different businesses. Afterwards, we have also pre-employment test. So please uh, do not feel bad when your teachers give you tests because that will prepare you for the test which you have to take. So yeah, and <coughs> the test, no? 
So you ask what kind of test are person that there are some tests that measures um, your mental and uh, ability to not choose, and there are tests also that measure uh, that the measure that gives us indicators of who you are as a person, you know, personality. Yeah. And then of course there are further interviews and assessment. I cannot uh, discuss that in detail with you, but it doesn't stop with those two. There are other interviews, sometimes it could be panel, it could be single, and it could be several. And then we also have several assessment tools. And then from there, there will be employment processing. Uh, once you have submitted everything and you were interviewed, there are other things that we do. We do some checks. <laughs> and then, as a team finally, this year you're selected as the candidate, you are the, the candidate. So, uh, you are called now and you're given a list of requirements that you have to submit, and also you have to undergo two physical PM. So, I suggest you be healthy and um, live well. <laughs> and um, uh, maybe uh, it, it's always good to be healthy. People think that you, when you're young, I know your health pick out automatic. Hindi yan. If you don't eat well, then kumisan, yan, we have cases, anemic, siguro ka puyat ka ka Facebook. <laughs> uh, or um, kumisan, low, uh, low blood, you know, usually anemic, ano, or ano po ba, usually, usually, ano, usually, do sila hindi, ano, eh, sa blood, ano, ano, siguro kulang sa tulog at saka sa blood. But uh, we do have a very thorough and then after the same of examining PE, that was the subject of pre employment requirement. The next day is the job offer. You are offered to have a new job, and then um, you are given parang, uh, the details, the benefits that you will get, and also what the company expects from you if you accept the job. After the job offer, of course, your place, you start your starting the whole series of all the things you have to do, and then there's onboarding, para orientation. Well, we allow smokers. We allow smokers here, and then those who are those who love.